Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is doing well. Today I will be testing out, reviewing and swatching this beautiful Milani lipsticks. But I didn't just get lipsticks, I also got the new Milani lip balms. So I have three of the lip balms that I was able to purchase. So I'm gonna be swatching them, putting them on my lips so you guys can see how they look. I'm also going to show you which eyeliners you can match with them. So if you're interested and if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing, it will mean the world to me. Now let's get right into the video. So let's talk about the Milani Color Fetish Matte Lipsticks. I was able to pick up two and the ones that I picked up are the Tease, which is this one, which is a beige nude, and the Sensual, which is this beautiful dark chocolate brown, which is kind of an espresso brown. Now, these are on the Milani website, $13.95. I was able to grab this for $11, I think $11.95 from Shoppers Drug Mart, which is here in Canada. So a little bit about this lipsticks. I have here that they are an ultra creamy, pigment rich lipstick in a range of nudes designed to complement every skin tone. So I love that they're all nude colors, they're all different type of brown. With a luxurious soft velvet matte finish, this high comfort lipstick glides seamlessly onto lips for full coverage. Can't wait to test them out. And these are supposed to keep your lips smooth, soft, because it has hyaluronic acid. So let's go ahead and apply this one first. So we're gonna go in with the lipsticks and then we're gonna go in with the lip balms. And I will tell you more about those lip balms as well. So we're gonna go in with teas. This is this beautiful nude brown. It's like a beige nude. And it's a very pretty lipstick as you can see. Look at that color. I'm gonna match with the ColourPop Lippy Pencil in the shade BFF. I think it's a pretty good match. So let's go ahead and line the lips. So as you can see, this is a very nude lip liner. And I'm gonna go with this color and I'm gonna swatch it for you guys so you guys can see before it goes onto my lips how it looks on the actual skin. A very nice nude brown. So let's put this on the lips now. So as you can see, it's a very beautiful nude beige brown. It has glided so soft on the lips. It's a matte finish, so there's absolutely no lip gloss in them. It has hyaluronic acid. It makes the lips very, very soft and comfortable. So I'm happy I was able to pick up this beautiful nude shade. Now I'm gonna wipe this off and go into the next lipstick that I was able to pick up. Okay, so the next one is this beautiful espresso brown shade. This is such a gorgeous color and I'm gonna pair this with the ColourPop Lippy Pencil in the shade Control, CTRL, which is this, this beautiful brown. You can see that they go very nice together. Let me swatch this lip liner beside it. So this is for the first one that we just put on so you guys can see. Now let's go in with this one. You can see this one is darker which matches this lipstick right here. Ooh, this is such a beautiful lip color. And there's the Milani lipstick. Again, it's a matte lipstick. Now let's go ahead and apply the lip liner now and then the lipstick. Wow, I never had such a dark lip color before, but this dark lip color, it's very good to wear with a very natural eye look as I'm wearing right now. You can see that the ColourPop Lippy matches very good with this lipstick in case you're wondering what lip liner to use. I think it just looks beautiful. So these are the Milani Color Fetish Matte Lipsticks. I was able to pick up these two beautiful shades, a very nude one and a very dark one. I believe this is the darkest one that they have. And it does transfer to your hand, as you can see. Maybe just let it sit longer. They're supposed to be, they're very velvety, 
they're very soft and they're not drying on your lips because a matte lipstick usually is drying on the lips I love this shade so much so now let's go into the lip balm so I can show you what I picked there okay so my lips are already hurting it's only been two lipsticks so for the lip balms I picked up three shades I picked up the um, last full in the shade this is like a peachy nude so this is what this one looks like beautiful then I picked up nylon this beautiful red color this is more of a mauve red and then here last one I have tied up by Milani and this is more of a caramel brown which I love so let's go in with the lightest one and this is in the shade lustful this is such a beautiful peachy nude you can see the difference that this is a rounded tip because it's a lip balm so basically this is a medium coverage buildable balm and lipstick all in one which is made with an 85 percent blend of nourishing oils that add on moisture and shine the 100 percent vegan formula combines the rich hydration of a balm the buildable color of a lipstick and the shine of a gloss all in one product. So again, this is $13.95. I was able to pick this up for $11.95 from Shoppers Drug Mart. So this one, so you can see the lip balm shade. It's basically what they're saying. It's a balm, lipstick, lip gloss, all in one. I have some lip liners for them, which I found in case you're interested. And this is the ColourPop Lip Liner in the shade O Sis. So you can see how beautiful it matches with the actual lip balm. So let's go ahead and apply the liner first. Oh my God, look at this. So because it's a lip balm, it's very good. It's a good idea to apply a lip liner because you don't want it to smudge or bleed. Um, down your lip. I think this is such a beautiful perfect match of a lip liner and lip balm. I love this formula. It is The lipsticks are very hydrating because of the hyaluronic acid But this is another step up there in being more hydrating because of the oils that it contains and it's just such a beautiful gliding lip balm. It's just with a tint of color and a little bit of shine it's just a perfect three products in one I totally agree so next we have this movie one this is in the shade nylon such a beautiful color and this is more of a movie one so I'm gonna pair it with this lip liner this is by Colourpop again and this is in the shade boarding pass so I will show you what the lip liner looks like. So here we have the lip liner. So the lip liner does look darker than this lip balm. You can see, but it's okay. It still matches pretty good. So this is what this lip balm looks like. Oh, so pretty. Now let's go ahead and apply it. So here is this beautiful shade. Look how pretty that looks as well. Now, one thing to remember is be careful when you push this on your lips. I pushed a little bit too hard and they're so super soft that they can actually bend. So don't squeeze so much out and make sure you don't push as hard because these are not lipsticks. These are lip balms, but I'm really loving the shade as well. I think it looks really pretty. So stay tuned because at the end, I'm going to tell you my favorite shades in this video. Okay, so the last one we have is in the shade Tied Up, this beautiful caramel brown. And I'm going to pair this with the ColourPop Lippy in the shade Curve 2, which is this one right here. So here we have the ColourPop Lippy. Ooh, look at this beautiful this is such a beautiful brown I love it okay let's apply it on the lips and see how it looks on the lips so this one this is what it looks like 
very pretty beautiful caramel brown shade I'm loving it so let me give you my final thoughts so I think that the lipsticks right here are so beautiful they are a matte color which I love a good matte lipstick but on top of it it has a very moisturizing feeling when you apply it to the lips without leaving your lips um, dry so I'm loving both of the shades they're actually both I can consider them my favorite for lipsticks I really really enjoy the dark one I rarely use such dark colors but I think with a very nude light look on your eyes I think that this matches really nice now for the lip balms I have all three shades right here they are all very very pretty as you can tell but I think out of the three, my favorite is the last one, which is the shade Tied Up, which is this beautiful caramel brown. I really love the shade. It has a little bit of a tint of orange with brown in it. Excuse my lips now because they have been put through all this wiping and applying, but I love this lip balm. Now, the difference between this lip balms and the lipsticks you can see that the lip balms are a little bit thinner than the actual lipstick and the um, design it has a black band with the golden milani writing on it this is a golden band with the milani encryption on it so that's the only difference and also the formula the lip balms are more balmy looking with a tint of color and with a little bit of shine added to it. So basically like three products in one, they're saying. And this beautiful lip matte, matte lipsticks are just, I think one of the best matte lipsticks I have ever owned because of the hydration that it gives to the lips. So yeah, this is the review on the Milani Fetish matte lipsticks and the Milani Fetish lip balms love love them and if I can find the rest of the shades I will definitely go purchase them they're a great deal so I hope you really enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to subscribe it will mean so much to me and I will see you in my next one love you guys bye